I had, in, in my early to mid 20s, a root canal on my lower right molar and it failed. <laughs> I had to have it retreated and I had a crown and then another crown and it's a long story. And for the last probably five years, I've walked around with this tooth with a vertical fracture, terrified of what, what was gonna happen because <laughs> I knew I was gonna lose this tooth and I didn't want to and I was scared. And so when I came to see Dr. Alfano, I was in somewhat of a crisis. The tooth was um, reinfected and it was very sore. And I knew that this was probably the last time because <laughs> I kept prolonging it and prolonging it because I know what happens when you have a tooth that's compromised as this tooth was. And so I made my consultation and I went to see Dr. Alfano and he assured me that everything was gonna be fine. And he was so right. I mean, his staff was amazing. I was in and out of there. Um, he told me I might have a little bruising, a little swelling, a little tenderness, but quite honestly, I went to work the next day. Um, three days after my treatment, I went to um, a seminar and was around uh, multiple staff members and no one ever knew because I didn't really swell at all or have hardly any discomfort. It was remarkable. And then I went, I mean, I'm, I'm a little over a week for my implant. And again, they said day three, you might be sore. You, you may have um, a little tenderness in the implant site. I mean, I, ha I was a little tender from the injection, but I, I followed his directions and it was unbelievable. I mean, I, at the end of the day, I don't know why I stressed so much or prolonged this for such a long period of time, thinking that it was gonna be this ordeal. And I was really, you know, I'm, I'm not a typical patient. I do have dental background. I know what happens and, you know, I'm, I'm just so eternally grateful that the process was so easy and, you know, it was worth every penny. I would do it again. I would do it sooner. I wouldn't walk around with this aggravated, unhappy tooth as long as I did. And it was really on a scale of one to 10, Dr. Alfano, his staff, um, as far as being professional and, you know, just human. Um, on a scale of one to 10, they were an 11. Honestly, I would, I, it was, Again, an extraordinary experience. I can't even begin to say what a pleasant outcome this has all been for me. Had I left it, God only knows what other things would have happened um, to the bone and other things like that that I, I know can happen. And you know, I, I really didn't want a conventional bridge because you know the teeth surrounding this tooth that I lost have little to no restorations and. You know, here I am walking around without this tooth and I'm doing all my chewing on the, the left side. And, you know, I am very much looking forward to having my tooth back and having a full complement of teeth um, so that I don't have other things that happen down the road. But again, if you are someone who is concerned about tooth loss or, you know, what's gonna happen if you, you miss or lose a tooth, um, there's, there's just, dentistry nowadays is so un unbelievable. I mean, the, again, the technology, the equipment, um, you know, I'll be so excited when I do have my tooth back and then I'm back in business with all my teeth. Because <laughs> that, that to me is really very important. I don't want to have my tooth lost because one tooth lost relates to other teeth lost, other things that can happen. So I'm just grateful again for Dr. Arafano and his staff and the technology we have today that I am going to have all of my teeth by Christmas. <laughs>